Adobe Color is integrated with Adobe After Effects CC. To access your themes stored in your creative profile, go up to the Window menu, choose Extensions, and then choose Adobe Color Themes. This will open the Color Themes panel. Notice that there are three sections associated with this panel – Create, Explore, and My Themes. If you click My Themes, all the themes that you created using the Adobe Color Service, whether it was using the website, mobile app, or other Adobe applications, they will appear here. In this section, you can filter by all themes or you can choose to display just themes that you mark as favorites. Also notice that you can perform a keyword search. For example, if you're looking for a particular color theme associated with a keyword, you can do that here. If I wanted to find a color theme that used the keyword outside, I could type that in and when I press enter, all themes that use that keyword will appear. This keyword search is available for both the My Themes section as well as the Explore section. Speaking of the Explore section, let's click on that button to view it. This allows you to view themes created by the community. The menu gives you a few filtering options such as viewing all themes, most popular themes, the most used themes, and random themes. All themes have options which you can access by clicking on the small triangle in the lower right of the theme. A menu will open with various commands for editing the themes, adding it to your favorites, or viewing it online. Let's review the Create section. Here you have the ability to create a color theme directly in After Effects and have those themes synced to your creative profile. Start by choosing an option from the Color Theory menu. Next. Mix colors by dragging the dots within the color wheel. Below, you can drag the colors around to change the order of how they appear within the theme. And with a the color selected, you can mix different color by using the various points within the wheel, dragging the sliders, or typing in values for the various color mixtures below. Once you're happy, you can name and save your theme. Once a theme is saved and synced to your creative profile, through the Adobe Color Service, it will be available to other Adobe desktop and mobile applications. When you create a theme in this panel, however, it cannot be associated with a Creative Cloud library. It's simply synced to the Adobe Color Service. With this panel open, you have the ability to use the eyedropper from any color control inside of After Effects to sample from the color swatch within the panel. What's great about this panel is Adobe allows you to quickly and easily access color themes that you've created using the Adobe Color Service.